Let's learn how to display uh, charts or tabular data based on the scripting uh, code. Uh, suppose there is an icon which says means I wanted to display the tab data in tab tabular format and once clicked on this uh, data will be displayed in the uh, tabular format. However, when, when clicked on chart icon on the data will be displayed uh, on the uh, in the chart format so this is what we wanted to uh, do it and we can do with this uh, with the use of the scripting uh, so let's do uh, do it how how we can do it now what uh, what first first step which uh, is uh, we need to add tables we need to add tables and then um, a chart based on uh, on top of it means both of the tables and uh, chart should be on the same line so i have just added a chart from here and the table from here and uh, if you can see uh, how to align that so you can see the margin from here means so on the table uh, you can say the top margin would be let's say means we do have 128 and similar to what a chart will be also we will set the same way uh, you can see uh, when we click on chart means it's almost uh, same or we can say it's so that both of them will be aligned uh, on same once we have done this we need a uh, icon to be displayed for that i have added uh, image uh, to uh, to add the image i have done this from adding image from here once we add a image click on this image we'll get uh, we uh, it will ask for the image to be dis, uh, taken from our local system or from the server as, as well so and then we can uh, uh, paste uh, add it here once we have uh, done this i have just rename it as switch to table display is the one name and switch to chart display so just for um, understanding purpose i uh, have given the name now to switch actual switching when we uh, wanted to do is uh, just go to the scripting of this uh, so when we wanted to uh, say uh, chart display uh, we we will write some scripting on this what we wanted to uh, do is we wanted to when a chart data is displayed we wanted to display the a tab a table icon and uh, we wanted to hide the uh, tabular data but uh, we wanted to uh, display the chart data now uh, when we say uh, when we say switch to chart display icon when we uh, uh, user clicks on the switch to chart display option we wanted to uh, set chart as visible and table as uh, invisible so we can say first as uh, chart one is uh, set visible and uh, table one as uh, set visible false so this is what we need and also we wanted to display a, a table display as true and um, what means that is the icon which is there and also chart as a false now the similar thing we, which we wanted to do but uh, in the repo, uh, opposite direction uh, for the other icon as well so for this what we can do we uh, we can write uh, this as false and this as true so on, on table display we wanted to display a chart as making as chart as uh, false visible and table we wanted to display and also we uh, wanted to uh, hide the table icon but uh, we wanted to display the chart icon so this way uh, we can do it on initialization as well uh, we wanted to write uh, we, we we just wanted to add uh, chart one dot set visible as false at the first place and both the charts we don't want to be uh, shown at the first place when the application is run so let's run this now you can see when it is run uh, we, uh, it just shows the uh, two icons which is uh, tabular and uh, chart when we click on chart the chart will be displayed and the uh, chart icon will be uh, invisible now when we wanted to display in the tabular format just click on this tabular format now this data will come in tabular format uh, and the graph chart will be icon will be displayed here so this way we can uh, switch like this and uh, this will work uh, so this is what we wanted to uh, we can uh, do with this uh, application now you can see uh, this is the functions which we wanted to do is both the images and the script we uh, write so that's it from this video. If you have any question, then please put it in comment section. Thank you.